नमस्कार आप सभी का स्वागत है इंडिया न्यूज में मैं हूँ आपके साथ कशिश पांडे तो आज हमारे साथ मौजूद हैं द वेरी वेल नोन सर्जर फ्रॉम यूएस डॉक्टर शंकर नायडू एंड द बिकमिंग प्रोड्यूसर ऑफ बॉलीवुड एंड टॉलीवुड आपका स्वागत है सर इंडिया न्यूज में थैंक यू थैंक यू सो सर माई फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज सर फ्रॉम वेयर डिड यू गेट द आइडिया टू मेक दिस मूवी I've been in um, living in US for last 30 years. So I left India when I was 27. So I, I lived more my, my life until now in US. But my heart and soul lives in Mother India, in even though I lived more there. From there, I can look at India from outside perspective. What is the biggest threat to our country at this point with the current geopolitical situation? China is our biggest threat. As a doctor, I took care of a lot of COVID patients. I know how COVID came from. Even though there are controversies about COVID origin, when you go back to the days of uh, 2019, 20, and then studying it, it came from Wuhan lab. As a surgeon, as a doctor, I took care of so many sick patients, and eight million people died worldwide so far, and so many families destroyed, businesses destroyed. And then China has been a constant threat to India from 1950s, along the borders, renaming our Arunachal Pradesh names, taking the Tibet, and then taking the Tibet as a, their uh, door to get into the India, killing our soldiers in Galwan Valley. That's when I decided to make a movie. In a way, we will tell China as it is. They are polished. They work in a subtle way. They don't show up like a Pakistan, but they always underneath. They're coming under like water on the rug to get into our borders, and then openly supporting Pakistan, supporting terrorism, supporting LT, you know, Lashkar-e Toiba terrorist. All of these bad deeds by China are never told in a movie form so far. So this is a high time. Someone has to tell this story. So we decided to bring this subject. In a movie form, in a power, you know, to be told in a powerful way, from a common person perspective. Okay, sir. So, sir, what would you like to say about your star cast of this movie? The star cast, our director Dean Raj has done an excellent job. Excellent job. He took about almost two to three months to find the right right people. The star cast has to be extremely hardworking because they traveled hours and hours on the road to get to the location. So they went almost. Close to the chain, the border, close to you know, Galvan Valley. That's where the most of the shoot happened. Um, the six of the main lead characters, played by Neeraj, Samaira, um, Sonam, and then um, our Peedan from uh, Northeast, and also Subo, Subaranjan, um, and then uh, Chakrabarti, um, Rajeshwari Chakrabarti. All these main characters. Extremely done well, uh, well talented. Extremely work hard. You will like all of them. They look like uh, real people walking in front of you when you see the movie. Yes, sir. I'm proud of them. Oh. Sir, कोई भी movie बनाने के लिए बहुत research करना पड़ता है. तो while researching on this movie, what points you get, where which the audience uh, still don't, now don't know. Audience need to be told. the truth what is going on in the last uh, what is has been happening in the last decades yeah. more so towards last few years number one how openly china supports pakistan and the terrorism recently when g27 sorry g20 summit happened in kashmir what did say china say china said we treat kashmir as politically or uh strategically disputed area that means they saying kashmir is not yours that's what they saying in a world stage and then more recently the culprit the terrorist who killed 165 people of our own people and some americans and 2611 mumbai attack we know who did that yeah. when america and india jointly proposed in united nations forum for a security council they tried to bring a resolution to declare 
Laskar Toiba terrorist Samid Mir as a global terrorist, to declare him as a global terrorist so we, that we can act on properly. What did the China do? China is a permanent member of UN Council. So they use that power to veto it, that means they block the resolution. So what does it mean? They're supporting the terrorists who are killing our people in daylight. What else we need to say China is our the most dangerous enemy? When they're helping terrorists and they're supporting terrorists in a global for, in a United Nations. United Nations is world forum for the nations to tell their opinion, have their the fair share in the justice. So we don't have justice in the UN also. Then who will bring the justice to us? So as a common people, as a common person, as a citizen, I have the responsibility, also right to speak our voice on the truth in the form of movie. Why movie? Because a movie can reach more people than a book. If I write a book, you cannot make a lot of people read about it. But movie can be watched by everyone. Everyone at the same time. So that's the intent of movie. Why are we, made it, why are we making it? It's a high time. This is the first ever made movie to talk about China's atrocities in a powerful way. Sir, while shooting this movie, which scene becomes your most favorite? The most favorite scene, there are so many of them. I, I mean, the entire movie is excellent, excellent. Uh, I cannot really pick one and another. Uh, almost every scene was very moving. But the last scene when uh, one of our lead characters says, he takes into his arms all other characters and they say, you know, we came from different parts of the country, but we are children of one mother, Mother, mother Bharat, India. Mother India. That, that probably takes, you know, everyone gets so tears into their eyes. Okay. Sir, Galwan Ghati attack mein jab Chin Bharat ke andar ghus ra tha. Matlab when they are entering into India, India. To sir, humare bhoat se jo javaan thai wo shaheed ho gai thai. There are total 20 uh, yes. soldiers uh, mm -hmm. jo shaheed ho gai thai. To unki family ke liye koi message aap dena chayenge? Ab tell me again in English. What message uh, would you like to give the martyrs family? Martyr's family, the message was given by our Prime Minister Ji. You know, we took that uh, clip of Prime Minister Ji, Narendra Modi Ji, the great leader, the great PM of our time. He addresses the nation. That's what we have in our heart. Your sacrifice, your story will be told in every household in this country, in this Bharat. We are a God. We are a God. Your Viragata, your story yeah. will be displayed, will be told in every household. And then he says, Bharat Mata Ki Jai. Yeah. So he was on behalf of 1.4 billion people. He was speaking on behalf of all of us. So we use the clip. And the same thing I would say here. So sir, in Ladakh, there is one place which name is Dalat Beg Oldie. वहाँ पे एक मेमोरियल बनाया गया है जो कि 20 हमारे सॉल्जर्स शहीद हुए थे 20 सॉल्जर्स जो शहीद हुए थे उनके नाम उसपे लिखे हैं सो वाइल्ड शूटिंग आप वहाँ पे गए थे डिड वी गो देयर वी ट्राइड वी डिड नॉट गेट परमिशन वी डिड नॉट गेट परमिशन एट दैट पॉइंट इट वाज स्टिल नॉट फॉर द पब्लिक आई � Sir, when this attack was happening, Galwan Ghati attack, so Richard Jadha, one of our Indian Bollywood actors, he had a tweet about it. Galwan says hi. So after that, the people who were in Bollywood were going to go against them. So, would you like to say something for those people who are in Bollywood, who are in their own country, 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 who are in their own country. What would you like to say about these kind of uh, people who says bad to their country? Okay? Yes. My opinion is same as uh, Vivek Agnihotri ji is like my god brother. We have the same philosophy. He wrote a book, Urban Naxalites. That means they sell the motherland for their own benefit. As you said earlier, I'm a surgeon. I do a lot of cancer operations. I, re I remove the cancer from the liver, intestine, pancreas, 
so many things I do cancer operations almost every day. But there is also a cancer in our mother, in a, in a motherland, in the country. The cancer is in the form of antinationals, some of the lestis, who support China than India. Yeah. A lot of them are here. So those cancer, they are, I call them as a parasite. That means they live on your flesh. They live on the blood and sweat of common citizens who give them jobs, who give them a shelter. They eat our hard-earned money and resources, but they backstab us. For me, in my opinion, they're pure parasites and they need to be watched. They need to be put in proper places. That's what I would tell them. I would tell them, beware next time when you say something. We're not going to keep silent anymore. Okay. So, sir, what message would you like to give the audience of India News or NewsX? The two things, um, every common citizen is a hero. You are a hero because how hard you work to take care of the family and also contribute to the motherland. So that power in you, in all of us, we need to make use of it. Every day, in every day matters. Always, always, we owe a lot to our mother, mother, mother India, and let it reflect in everything what we do, how we speak, how we respect our system, law and order, how we contribute to this country to thrive and to grow and become one of the most powerful country on this planet. That's what I would sincerely request every citizen. So when this movie is going to be released on big screen? It is being released, uh, it will be released next week, July 14th. 14th of July? Yes, yes. So, sir, Censor Board has cut 70 scenes from your movie. Yes. What would you like to say to Censor Board why they have cut your uh, 70 scenes? It's a big number. You know, some of the minor things, we were not bothered about them. You know, some little dialogues here and there, we took care of it. The most upsetting, the saddening, or almost like a backstab, is, then, is when they said, Do not, you can't use the chena. You, you can't say chena in the movie. Yeah. And then you cannot say Galvan Valley. The movie, the whole movie, the theme, the, the thought of making this movie, it came after Galvan Valley incident happened. So we made this movie as a tribute to them. Now they, they come and say, you cannot use the Galvan Valley because that's a classified word. So that means they're telling us, part of our country, you cannot claim it. So if you cannot talk about our Galvan Valley, who else will talk about it? Either China is going to say Galvan Valley is your part of India. We have to say that, right? That is the most upsetting thing. Yeah. Second thing is about we cannot call China as a China. China. Well, I say you need to say poison as a poison. That is not sweet. That is not life saver. A scorpion is a scorpion. Right. An evil is a evil. China is China. Right. We tried every possible dialogue with them, debate with them, humbly requesting them have a, one of the cabinet ministers from information also on our behalf, he made a call. We did every attempt possible. They appeared, they listened to some of, some of them, but finally they took all these cuts into effect. So they deleting, they're making us to delete China name and then also Galvan Valley after all this hard work. But I'm coming forward to appeal to all the people, particularly also the media to talk on behalf of us. You will, when you see the movie, you, you, will, you will see every intent of what it is made for, what is the, the thought behind it, the intention, the high time for that, you will see all of that. So we're coming to the people rather than going to the court or trying to win the, the case over there. I thought, why don't we go to people directly and tell them what is happening there? That's why I'm here today. And then lastly, two more things. In the movie, I mentioned earlier, our Pradhan Mantri, Sri Narendra Modi ji, his message in the last part of the movie is about Galvan Valley matters, martyrs. 
he says that your stories will be heard in every household, Bharat Mata Ki Jai. They said you need to cut that scene because you cannot, use, you cannot have a politician scene shown in the movie. I asked them, Narendra Modi ji is not a politician. He is our prime minister. He is prime minister of our country. If you cannot say it's anything about our martyrs, who else is going to talk, talk about it? He is the head of our country at this point. But they blatantly, shamelessly asking PM of our country not to be shown in our movie. But this, my question was also, in many movies you see Indira Gandhi ji or Gandhi ji pictures on the wall, they were also politicians. Right. In the, the entire their career, they belong to a party also. Party. Just because Narendra Modi ji belonged to a party, you, you can't say, I mean, you cannot tell me that you cannot show that his message in the movie. The message is coming from prime minister. Is it intent of having Narendra Modi is not too visible in this powerfully made movie? I do not know the intention. There is some bad intention towards uh, the nationality, the theme of the movie. I do not know why. We'll have to find out. Yeah. So, uh, sir, this movie is 14 of July. Yes. Right. What is the name of this movie? Can you please tell our audience? The name of the movie is your name, Bharatians. Yeah. Bharatians is our name, all of our name. That's the name of the movie, Bharatians. So Bharatians, which is the box office for the movie, is coming on 14 July. So please go and watch this movie. And tell us in the comment section how you liked this movie after watching this movie. So thank you so much, sir, for joining us. Thank you so much.